hello friends welcome back to my youtube channel in this video tutorial i will show you how to fix battlefield 2042 not launching won't launch crashing crashes to desktop crashing at a startup freezing not loading stuck on loading screen or black screen on pc so without wasting any time let's jump to the fixes the first fix is to rename delete the battlefield 2042 folder in documents but make a note you must create a backup of this folder to desktop first because you will lose all the save game progress so here how to do it open file explorer then click on documents on the left now here first copy this folder and go to desktop and paste it to keep the backup and then you can either rename it you can rename it dot old and then you can launch the game and check or you can directly right click on it and select the option delete to delete it and then you can launch the game and check second solution is to change exploit settings only for battlefield 2042 exe file now to do so in windows search type windows security and open it then click on app and browser control then under exploit protection click on exploit protection settings then click on program settings now click on add program to customize click on plus icon then click on choose exact file path now browse to the game installation folder my game is installed in e drive but in your case it will be in c drive program files x86 steam steam apps common folder and here you will see the battlefield 2042 folder so you have to open that but in my case i have to go to the e drive steam library steam apps common battlefield 2042 folder and here you have to select this bf2042 exe file and then click open now after adding it you will see this type of pop-up screen so what you have to do you have to check mark this override system setting and make sure everything is off so you have to check mark this override settings so you have to check mark override system setting for every category and make sure everything is off so this is on so you have to turn it off now this is also on you have to turn it off so you have to make sure that you check mark all this option and make sure everything is off if anything is on then you have to turn it off Now this is again validated exception is on, you have to turn it off. Then again validated heap integrity is on, you have to turn it off. So you have to check mark all this override system setting next to each category and you have to make sure that everything is off. Let me check once again. This left turned on, so turn it off. So you have to make sure everything is turned off and you have to check mark every box and then click on apply click yes to allow now launch the game and check your problem is fixed or not later in future if you want to remove this and get back to default setting then simply click on remove and it will get back to default settings now third solution is to enable secure boot now for this fix i have made another video so you can check this video in my video description the link is given in video description and after enabling the secure boot you can launch the game and check and for more details about the secure boot you can go to the official ea website you will get this link in my video description so here you will learn how to check secure boot is enabled or not and how to enable it and check this video for detailed information and after enabling the secure boot you can launch the game and check now fourth solution is to modify the game launch option so try minus dx11 or dx12 to do this open steam go to library right click on battlefield 2042 then click on properties and here type minus dx11 close the tab now launch the game and check if not working then again go to properties this time type minus dx12 close the tab now launch the game and check your problem is fixed or not 
if it's still not working then again go to properties and remove this command and then follow other fixes mentioned in this video fifth solution is to you have to close the daemon tools uninstall interception driver auto hotkey ds4 windows virtual controller etc close these in task manager and disable them in device manager if applicable so if you are getting this error this software cannot be used at the same time as game this soft limited daemon tools then you can check this video i will provide the link in, in the video description the title is fix battlefield 6 error software cannot be used at the same time as game is soft limited daemon tools though it is mentioned battlefield 6 but it will work for battlefield 2042 as well so if you are also getting this error this software cannot be used at the same time as game virtual controller then watch this video the link is provided in the video description and if you are getting this error this software cannot be used at the same time as the game auto hotkey then you can check this video the link is given in video description and after following this steps mentioned in this videos and then you can launch the game and check if your problem is fixed or not now six solution is to uninstall and reinstall ea anti cheat and you have to also uninstall the third party anti cheat software such as face it anti cheat etc so to uninstall and reinstall anti cheat go to steam go to library right click on battlefield 2042 click on manage then browse local files it will take you to the game installation folder now open the ea anti cheat folder now double click ea anti cheat installer exe file click on run click yes to allow now here click on uninstall all this will uninstall ea anti cheat for all ea app games but you don't have to worry so simply click on uninstall all and once you see the uninstall success message close this and then you can launch the game and while you launch the game from here it will reinstall the ea anti cheats and your game will work fine now if you don't see ea anti cheat in game folder then in that case you can install ea anti cheat from ea website so go to this ea official website link will be given in the video description scroll down then click on download ea javelin anti cheat installer and once this ea anti cheat installer exe file get downloaded double click it to install it and after installing the ea anti cheat you can launch the game and check now seven solution is to perform clean installation of graphic card driver so if you are nvidia user then you can go to the nvidia official website if you are md user then you can go to the amd official website and if you are intel graphic card driver then you can visit the intel official website so i am showing the example of nvidia graphic card driver so go to this nvidia official website and then here you have to do the manual driver search so select your version of graphic card driver then select the windows operating system and then click on find now whatever is the latest version of the graphic card driver you have to download and install it so click on view then click on download and once this exe file get downloaded you have to double click it to run the downloaded exe file and select yes to allow and then click okay you will see this screen click on agree and continue then select custom advanced option and then click on next then tick mark perform a clean installation box and then click on next and after the clean installation of graphic card driver is done restart your pc and then you can launch the game and check now if still your problem is not fixed then you can also roll back graphic card driver so if you run an nvidia graphic card driver then revert back to version 577.00 and if you run an amd graphic card driver then revert back to version 25.3.1 and then you can launch the game and check so i am showing the example of nvidia graphic card driver so go to the official website of nvidia graphic card driver now select your version of graphic card driver from here select the windows operating system then click on find scroll down click on view more version scroll down you have to roll back to version 577.00 so this is the 577.00 so click on view then click on download and once this 577 version of nvidia graphic card driver exe file get downloaded double click it and then launch it and then follow the same steps 
as shown earlier to install it and then you can launch the game and check if your problem is fixed or not this has helped many players to fix the issue i hope this will work for you as well fix 9 is to install directx so go to this official microsoft website link is given in video description click on download then double click on this dxwebsetup.exe file and install it this will install the directx on your pc and then you can launch the game and check 10 solution is to run the game as an administrator from the game installation folder or try running the game in compatibility mode to do so open steam go to library right click on battlefield 2042 select manage browse local files it will take you to the game installation folder now right click on bf 2042 exe file and select properties go to compatibility tab then tick mark run this program as an administrator hit apply ok and then launch the game from the game installation folder from here itself and then check problem fixed or not if not then tick mark this run this program in compatibility mode for select windows 8 hit apply ok then launch the game and check if it's still not work then select windows 7 hit apply ok then launch the game and check if it's still not working then this time select disable full screen optimization option as well then hit apply ok then launch the game and check if it's still not working then do the same thing with bf2042 trial version and then check if it's still not working then right click on ea anti cheat dot game service launcher exe file select properties go to compatibility tab check mark run this program as an administrator hit apply ok and then you can launch the game and check and now when you put all this check mark in compatibility tab and still your problem is not solved then untick all these boxes hit apply ok do the same thing with this if you have changed the compatibility setting of this exe file also then uncheck all the boxes from the compatibility tab for bf2042 trial exe file also and also right click on ea anti cheat game service launcher go to properties compatible tab uncheck run this program as an administrator hit apply ok and then follow other fixes mentioned in this video 11 solution is to if you are a windows security users then allow the game exe file to through the control folder access and firewall to do so in windows search type windows security and open it click on virus and threat protection click on manage ransomware protection click on allow an app through control folder access click yes to allow click on add an allowed app then click on browse all apps now go to game installation folder open battlefield 2042 game folder select bf 2042 exe file and click open again click on add an allowed app browse all apps go to game installation folder select bf2042 trial version also click open again click on add an allowed app then browse all apps select ea anti cheat game service launcher and click on open now go back then click on firewall and network protection click allow an app through firewall then click on change settings then click on allow another app click on browse now go to game installation folder steam library steam apps common open battlefield 2042 game folder select the bf2042 exe file click open and then click on add and make sure both private and public is ticked marked then again click on allow another app click on browse select bf2042 trial exe file click open click on add make sure both private and public is ticked marked then again click on allow another app click on browse select ea anti cheat game service launcher click open click on add make sure both private and public is ticked mark then click on ok to save changes now you can launch the game and check now if you are using any third party antivirus programs such as komodo avast casper sky avg mac cafe norton bit defender then allow the game exe file to your antivirus program as well and then you can launch the game and check if your problem is fixed or not now 12 solution is to run the game on dedicated graphic card driver to do so in windows search type graphic settings and open it then click on add desktop app now go to game installation folder steam apps common battlefield 2042 folder select bf2042 exe file click on add it is already added so expand it and then click on high performance and then you can launch the game and check 
if it's still not working then again click on add desktop app select battlefield 2042 trial version and then click on add expand it then click on high performance i can also see another battlefield 2042 expand it as well then click on high performance and then you can launch the game and check if your problem is fixed or not 13 solution is to verify the game files so open steam go to library right click on battlefield 2042 go to properties go to installed files then click on verify integrity of game files and uh, after the verification of the game files you can launch the game and check if your problem is fixed or not 14 solution is to install visual c++ files so go to this website it is official microsoft website link is given in video description scroll down download x86 version and x64 version download both the version and then run it one by one and if you see install option then install it if you see repair option then repair it click yes to allow double click the x64 version if you see repair option then repair it if you see install option then install it click yes to allow and after the successful installation of both the version of microsoft visual c++ files you can launch the game and check if your problem is fixed or not now 15 solution is to run ea app or steam app as an administrator so if you have the game in ea app then right click on ea app and then click on run as administrator and then you can launch the game and check if you have the game in steam then right click on steam then click on run as administrator and then you can launch the game and check if a problem is fixed or not 16 solution is to update windows so click on windows icon then go to settings go to windows update on the left then click on check for updates and if you find any updates available for your windows then download and install them and then you can restart your pc and after the restart of the pc you can launch the battlefield 2042 and check if your problem is fixed or not 17 solution is to unplug external devices such as hotas paddles racing wheel razor tatras disconnect all the additional usb adapter connected to pc disconnect additional joystick controllers connected if you are connected to vpn then disconnect it disable overlay close all the overlay apps such as discord nvidia app close all the overclocking application msi afterburner riva tuner turn off razor synapse razor lighting effects and msi dragon center course air software closed third party services such as nahemic services lighting service dot exe etc from task manager remove the undervolt then you can launch the game and check now 18 solution is to this is the last solution if none of the solution work for you then the last solution is to uninstall and reinstall the game so simply uninstall battlefield 2042 delete the game folder related to battlefield 2042 then restart your pc and reinstall the game to c drive ssd drive if earlier you have installed the game on external drive such as e drive or f drive then this time reinstall the game on c drive and then you can launch the game and check if already installed in c drive then try installing it to another ssd drive and then you can launch the game and check so by this way you can fix battlefield 2042 not launching won't launch crashing crashing to desktop crashing at a startup freezing not loading stuck on loading screen or black screen problem on pc so that's all for this video if this video helped you then please like and subscribe to my channel share this video and hit the bell icon to get the latest updates thank you